where we last saw things, Floyd is going to have his father live with him. And we know they've had a complicated relationship. What can you preview about what that change might bring for the two men? Yeah, well, I mean, naturally you have a, an older gentleman who's kind of more or less set in his ways uh, and, and deal, dealing with the fact that he's bipolar as well. And you have Floyd, who's uh, a young guy who's trying to rekindle this relationship or, or lack thereof with his father. And um, he's a single bachelor, you know, so that's going to cause some, some, some conflict for sure. Uh, and some comedic uh, moments. Uh, I think that will be hilarious um, for the audiences to see. And um, yeah, just uh, a lot of conf conflict and comedy yeah. with the two of them. It's hilarious. Regarding the mental illness, uh, he's aware of it. He treads lightly. And um, it's not as shocking as, as it was in the beginning when we first find out that he, had, that he is bipolar uh, and you know, Floyd is extremely frustrated, especially when they went to go fishing that time. His father wouldn't let it go and just wanted to keep fishing despite them always being arrested. Um, that was a tough time for Floyd. But now he's like sort of taking it in stride, which, which I'm glad to see. Yeah. Well, as you alluded to, again, again, as a preview, there is a woman in his life. We've seen him have hit or miss luck with relationships in the past. What is he looking for? No, I thought they've been going great. What do you, what do you mean? <laughs> It's been a, an adventure, certainly. <laughs> um, what is he looking for right now? And what does he think that this relationship could be? Yeah, I think um, he's learned a lot from his past relationships, uh, particularly his most recent one, where you know he always envisioned himself being the traditional guy of the traditional family and ended up in a polyamorous relationship. So I think that cause him to be a little bit open-minded for example this person that he's interested in now she's a traveling nurse and uh whereas in the beginning it's like uh you know i'm looking for something more permanent i don't know if that could work out this nurse reminds him hey you know i'm here for eight weeks maybe that could be fun yeah, let's have fun don't forget to have some fun and he's like yeah i guess i guess we could so he's opening up you know he's not going to be so set in his ways and uh he's looking for love always he's looking for the one uh someone to knock him off his feet someone he can build with build a family with and uh maybe he's found that well as we're getting towards the end game of this series and certainly it seems like both romance and family is going to play a part in floyd's eventual end storylines how much if any is malvo being a part of it? Is she mentioned at all is there kind of conversation about what that relationship was and the child that's involved what can you share about that yeah, I think that to probably to minimize confusion and, and to, to, to not have people just be all over the place like Floyd's relationships have, have been, um, I, I think that they're, they're, they're choosing, electing to focus on his current one, one, one at a time. And much the same when, when we were uh, uh, shooting the stuff with Malvo, uh, there, there wasn't, no, if I recall correctly, there was no mention of Evie. Um, and, and, and by the way, shouts out to Margot Bingham, who played E.B., um, uh, Francis Turner, who, who played Malvo, and um, uh, Toya Turner, who, who plays Gabrielle. Just amazing scene partners. Um, they're talented. They've elevated me, um, comforted me, made me feel great, always served the purpose of what the scenes were. And since the season is, is wrapping up, I, I just wanted to say uh, thank you to all of them. Uh, and yeah, it was just, it's, just, it's been great. So, so, so the answer that to wrap that up, uh, we didn't mention past relationships before, and I don't think that they're going to do that so much, even though, you know, that we, we, we do have a kid together, <laughs> right? Um, and w w I, I would imagine that we, we would see the kid in the, in the, in the finale coming up for mm -hmm. sure.